What's up, Mitten Squad? My name is Paul, and welcome back to another Top 10 video. In this video, I'll be going over 10 things you didn't know about Mario Party. Number 10. In the Order Up minigame game in Mario Party 4, there is a poster with the caption, Kinopio Burger, as Kinopio is Toad's Japanese name. This is a detail that was overlooked during localization. Number 9. An early version of the game board Toad Road in Mario Party 9 can be found in the game's data. The early version included three mountains, a cloud, many toad houses, and a wiggler, who was probably the board leader. Number 8. Mario Party 1 supports the 64DD as a possible game add-on. The 64DD was an accessory available for the Nintendo 64 that allowed the console to use discs. It was a colossal failure. While the US version plays a black screen when there's a 64DD attached to the system, the Japanese and European versions actually recognize the 64DD and check for a disc. If it's the wrong disc, an error message will appear in either Japanese, English, French, or German, depending on the selected language. Number 7. Luigi mentions the Mario Party series in the first page of his diary in Mario Party, saying, quote, Page 1. Once again, my brother went on an exciting journey. Once again, he went alone. It's so unfair. I remember the carefree days when we played golf and tennis and had parties. I remodeled the house and made a secret basement my brother had no idea. It's the perfect place to write in you, my secret diary. End quote. Number 6. At the end of Bowser's Tower in Mario Party Island Tour, after defeating Bowser, he will appear again and say Bwahahaha, you celebrate too soon! That wasn't even my final form. This is a reference to Dragon Ball Z where Frieza says, you fool, this isn't even my final form. Number 5. Of the many characters to be playable across the Mario Party series, only four of them have been playable in every Mario Party game, those being Mario, Luigi, Yoshi, and Princess Peach. Wario was close. The only game he wasn't playable in was Mario Party Advance. Speaking of characters, the game that had the most playable characters was the Beach Volley edition of Mario Party 8, having 15 playable characters. Number 4. Toadsworth was planned to be in Mario Party 8, as there are his unused voice clips found in the BRSAR file that stores all the sound clips of the game. It is unclear what role he was going to have in the game, as he only has two voice clips, happy and sad. Number 3. Mario Party 8 was recalled in the United Kingdom due to the character Kamek saying the word spastic. The word is considered to be highly offensive in the UK as it has been used to mock the disabled. A similar issue occurred with the word in Mind Quiz, Your Brain Coach. Number 2. There are a few minigames which were cut from the first Mario Party but can still be found in the game's files. The games are All or Nothing, Tour de Mario, Bungie Jump, Same Game, and Yoshi's Tongue Meeting. Some of them are playable and can be accessed with the use of a GameShark device. Number 1. Using action replay codes in Mario Party 7, it is possible to play as red and green Koopa Kids. Their character models and behaviors are mostly broken, as they are missing several animations. There is a value for the blue Koopa Kid as well, however using the code will make the game crash. Alright, that's gonna do it for this top 10 video about Mario Party. If you enjoyed the video or learned anything new, leave a like. Leave a dislike if you didn't enjoy the video or didn't learn anything. Leave a comment if you have any suggestions for any future top 10 video about any game or game character. Follow me on Twitter, at MittenSquad. My name is Paul of Mitten Squad. Have a wonderful day.